Cocaine so, music faggots. Dolph don't, I don't know the cocaine, no. That ain't even, that ain't Dolph. Listen, I wouldn't even feel right. I feel so out of place over there with some faggots. Man, come on. What's going on, y'all? This salute. This true results. We got to chop it up about Lil Migo. And did they get him again? Because I've been hearing a lot of people say he got jacked again. Well, guess what? Um, I got the affidavit on the dude that got arrested for robbing somebody but I didn't see Migos name in there it's a whole nother victim and we about to read this affidavit to put a little bit of truth in the atmosphere now with all this all this expensive jewelry I don't know where uh, people are getting the money, the guns, because in this affidavit that we're about to read, it only says, it only lists three items that was taken. Or is that just some blogging shit? I don't know, maybe it's a cover-up. But uh, somebody was sitting on some expensive jewelry. And uh, if anybody know anything about this affidavit, that you want to get in the comment section and clear up. Feel free to do that because I don't see anything about no guns, uh, no, no, no sixty thousand out of cash. I don't know uh, where that come from. But without further ado, let's read the affidavit and uh, let me get back to business. Not a little flipper man. True. All right, out of Shelby County, I let blah 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 uh, appear before me, Sergeant Arnold, on the twenty sixth day of June, two thousand twenty four. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Taylor D. Bell, uh, 21 years old, uh, did unlawfully commit aggravated robbery. They scratched out the home invasion, aggravated burglary, possession of firearm during commission to commit dangerous felony, theft of property, 10 to 60,000, uh, acting in concert to wit aggravated assault, aggravated assault again. And uh, these are the facts. On June 26, 2024, Lawrence Taylor, it didn't say a Darius Smith, because that's Lil Migo's name, a Darius Smith. I don't know who this Lawrence Taylor is, but this is public record. And this is as the affidavit reads. Once again, on June 26, 2024, Lawrence Taylor was robbed at gunpoint by three males as he was entering his home his home at uh on leatherwood leatherwood Ave. taylor recognized one of the suspects as taylor d bell bell went to school with taylor's son and frequented his home in the past on several occasions. So whoever this Lawrence Taylor is, the robber, one of the robbers, uh been in and out of his house several times as he states and went to school with his son. Can anybody shed light on who this may be? His son, that is. And even this guy. Let's continue. Uh Bell placed Taylor in a chokehold while pointing a handgun to his head. Taylor, to his head, Taylor, Bell then forced Taylor into his residence. While inside of the residence, Bell told Taylor he would kill him if he did not give him the jury, specifically the jury. I don't know where the cash and the guns and all that come from. But this is what the affidavit said, and uh, Lawrence Taylor is the one that's telling this story to the police. If he did not give him the jury, Taylor 
advise. advise Taylor advise a diamond Cartier watch worth $24,000 a designer ring worth $6,000 and a diamond necklace worth $15,000 were taken from his home along with $1,375 in cash. I do not see anything about $60,000 or no guns. And keys to his three vehicles and home, which were taken out of his pocket. After the robbery took place, Taylor ran behind the suspects, that's with an S, before one of them turned around and fired two shots at him. Lawrence Taylor was shown a six-person photographic yeah, lineup and positively identified his son's schoolmate that been in and out of his house as Taylor Bell. Yeah, so that's that. <clears throat> okay, so those are the facts as stated by the affidavit. And uh, until this day, I, I don't know. Y'all tell me where y'all get the guns and the $60,000 because... Well, that's Taylor's statement right there. <clears> the <throat> only thing we learned is that it was uh, three suspects. And uh, one of them turned around and started firing. And Taylor recognized his son's friend. And that's where we're going to leave it at right now. Y'all like, share, subscribe, I would support. Get in the comment section if you can identify who may be uh, A.L. Taylor's son. And is this a cover-up or... I don't know how it get links back to Migo. Well, somebody knows something about something. Uh, catch up, Dodd, Sarah, and True Results number two. Have a blessed Sunday, and uh, we'll be back later on tonight. Like, share, subscribe. True.